Hi, I am Sheikh Mahbub Basha. Welcome to my channel. Happy learning. Welcome back. Today we learn about how to add an audio file to our PPT and how to link to any one text or an action. We will learn today. Open your PPT. I have already opened the previous project in which we have practiced triggering of an image and triggering of a video. Select a new slide. Observe all the slides are with our template. Select a new plain slide. Selected. Copy this heading from the previous slide to our new slide. There it is. Parts of I. Let us change it to myopia. For the tutorial purpose, I have selected the topic myopia for today. The text color instead of white, I have selected black, and the length of the shape is adjusted. Now go to insert, select a text box. Draw a text box on this slide and go to home, set your text color, size, bold, italic. So first we have selected the properties of text before typing itself. Now let us start the typing. Here this text box is selected to type the definition of the myopia in the previous class we have displayed the total definition in one text box just for practice today i am typing the definition in separate text box one line in one text box i am splitting the definition one line per text box here three text boxes i have selected and the definition of myopia i am typing from the first text box once it is filled i'll go to the next and when it is filled i'll go to the next now the definition is over adjust the lengths of the text boxes I would like to highlight this myopia word with a different color. Select this myopia spelling, go to format, change the font color, check which is suitable, select one interested color. Go to select all these text boxes, go to format, align left. In the first text box, I have given a tab also as it is the starting of the paragraph it is simple thing you can adjust you can learn on your own now let us add animation select the heading myopia go to animations add animations i am selecting float option set the start as after previous time as one second and delay 0.5 second it is all about your interest then select the one two three text boxes go to animation add animation apply select wipe and set the start option as after previous and set the timing delay time for three seconds and delay 0.25 seconds here in animation you can observe the stripes in the animation pane indicates the time gap and how much time it is taking so the wipe direction should be from left to right always it should be from left to right select left to right now our aim is to insert a audio go to insert go to media then select audio and then from our pc so here for tutorial purpose i have taken one ready-made audio file 
So place this audio out of this slide, either side or at the bottom of the slide. Observe carefully in the animation pane as and when you add this audio file, we got this one animation action with a on click option mouse symbol you can see here so the audio will play on a click action then select the audio go to play back then click a trim audio here first click and listen for then later you can trim it there is a green and a red hook like arrangement by drag to see and drop or sliding those uh, green and red uh, hooks, uh, you can select uh, a part of the audio. Distances, then the defect is called myopia. So, in this example, there is uh, something unnecessary at the beginning. So, I have selected uh, the necessary part from this audio file. Here, one important instruction, to see while playing this uh, audio file, listen but is carefully as you have typed on the slide, there are three lines, note down the timings in the audio file so that we can give the same time to this text lines animation. So roughly for the first line, I need five seconds and similarly second line five seconds and uh, the remaining third last line I should give three seconds see actually we want the heading to be displayed first so first line of this definition second line then third line but the audio which includes the definition the spell of all this definition it should start along with the first line so we should start this audio in the animation pane to the under the first line animation so there we should give it an option to start as a with the previous so the audio should start playing with the start of the first line so select the audio and change the option as with the previous click all play all Check uh, the whether the audio is uh, synchronizing with the text displaying or not. Go to slideshow and from this slide, so if an eye is the display of the first line the and the audio starting should be done simultaneously the at and distances, the second line should start uh, at for the audio. So if you find any disturbance. Uh, you go to animation pane you can adjust the timings given for this uh, text boxes uh, as per the, the audio file timings then if you the have, if everything is perfect then go then to the slideshow you can enjoy it so this is all for now we will meet some other time with uh, some other topic till then take care have a nice day thank you